we're seeing the windscreen camera. Take the next right. Or you're gonna be seeing me. Sorry about that if you can. Uh, I don't know how dark it is. <laughs> it's an early morning start. No, no, no. Do I try? No, I don't want to Chances. Because people are stupid. Let's go. Yeah. Good morning. Welcome. Yes. It's dark. It's wet. It's seven degrees outside and I'm being slightly weird. So it's like normal. <laughs> hey! Uh, right, I have just. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Started work early, got an early collection for an early delivery in Northampton. Uh, I have just been and got diesel. Uh, and I now. Shut up! Now heading to Z Collection, which is not far down the road. It's the door, people. You would have seen me go there. Well, oh, actually, no, you wouldn't actually have seen me go there, but you would have seen me leaving there many, many, many a time. I'm sure. Oh, boy. Uh, let's keep going. Go over the roundabout, taking the first exit. What? A miserable start to the morning. And what's the betting that people are going to be driving like complete and utter left. morons slash copper wombles? Yeah, see, I didn't swear. I, I tweaked it. And of course, the truck has decided it needs regen. Uh, it loves making noises. Admittedly, the DPF needs servicing on it. And yeah. It's booking it in to get it done. Takes time. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go and get myself loaded. And I'll catch up with you in a bit when hopefully there's a bit more daylight because it's a bit dark. I can hardly see. I am now loaded. Let me just get my coat off. It is still raining, but it's not raining as bad. And I am now loaded and have paperwork. Let's just hang that up so it's got a chance to dry off. Alright, so I pull out of their yard and then I'm then set the old satellite navigation. Why did that not go up? That's if I press the button. If you're wondering what button I'm talking about, capital video. Link somewhere. Right, let's just get out of there. Uh, uh, this yard always feels tighter than it actually is. It's quite deceptive. It just, yeah. I mean, not a bad today, especially the turn in. It just always feels tight than it actually is. And then you quite commonly get idiots come around this corner way too fast. Let's just check. Okay, regen, we get it. You're doing a regen. Right. And then pull left to hot. Right. Just pull it here a moment. OK. 
Okay. What's that left? So, I am going to... Hospital in Northampton. Definitely find the address because, well, it's a hospital. Chances are it's been there for some time. Yes, that is it. Okay. B6 and 7. Okay, interesting. Let's go. Hour and fifty. I've got to be there for nine o'clock. Yeah, should do it. As long as traffic's nice to me. Oh, morning. Hope you can see me now. After six hundred feet. Otherwise, I am you. I am talking to you like this, being gesticulating and stuff, and all you're seeing is the windscreen. Who knows? Uh. Also, who knows? I've just had a thought. Am I actually recording or a minute? Yes, I am recording here. So, good thing I double check that. I have to be careful about saying either word out loud. Because even though I don't say the previous trigger word, it has a habit of detecting it and turning off whichever mode I've told it to be in. Voice commands. So, anyway, how are you? After Good. A of a mile. Sorry for the jump cut there. I uh, just had uh, a phone call in the office, just checking that I'm going to be on time. So anyway, so yeah, uh, how are you? Hope you're good. How are me? I'm yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's leave it at that. Um, yeah. Uh, so, as, as it stands today, I have this one drop, uh, which is a nice change from yesterday when yesterday I was on locals and I had 13, 12 or 13 drops. I'll tell you one thing though, Pallet Network with a Moffit. Mwah! Chef's kiss that. Oh, oh, brilliant. But anyway, uh, yeah, got one drop. Um, I might be getting sent into the Pallet Network Hub uh, to collect some of the early pallets to bring them back to our yard. Don't know yet. Um, it's one of those of when I'm tipped, I'm to call. Um,
stop raining. And the buffer unit I've got on at the moment, uh, another driver normally uses it. I don't know what he's done to it, but uh, yeah, the, the seat is um, tatty. The foam is uh, exposed to the seat, and uh, yeah, I, I, I'm going to be using one of my uh, emergency lay-by bags to uh, cover the seat, otherwise I'm going to have a very wet bottom. But you know, it is what it is. We'll be fine. The second I start recording. Go on. After half a mile, exit the motorway. God knows why. There we go. Three miles. There's only one way to find out, and that is to get there. But I've got it in the rain to mark it off load. Roll up on my straps. Yay. Half a mile. My exit. Prepare to exit left after half a mile. Banshee delivering to a hospital as well. Hospital signs. As you can tell, you're going the right way. This Banshee delivering to hospitals. They don't like it when you shut them down, parking a truck somewhere. Beverage sit. After 100 feet, exit left. I am exiting it. And I want to the. Oh. After 600 feet, enter the roundabout the and hospital. take the first exit.
Nah, not quite. After 100 feet, turn right. That was a satisfying click at the same time. Painful click. Don't you do it, Mercedes. in a holding pattern at the moment, waiting for a phone call. So, uh, the site contact is on annual leave. <laughs> so I've just phoned their office, who's phoning one of the guys on site to say I'm here and to find out exactly where I'm meant to be going. Um, I'm doing my best to stay out of the way. It's never easy at hospital sites. It's the waiting game now for a phone call. Catch you in a moment. I hope I have more information. Right. To the wisdom, it was tight and an awkward reverse, so I didn't film it. And then on the estate's office people with well, the hospitals around so I couldn't film the offload either. Uh, right. Let's get out of here somewhere else. Just thought better double check. Yes, it did. I've been warned as well, there's a turn at the top here. That's incredibly nasty. This is going to be fun. So yeah, this slope, no, I've come out there, compound. I just have to reverse around this corner, all the way down this hill. After doing Basically, you see, I don't know if you see where that voxel is just about to go across. I came for that direction, that's a burn, and then reverse, snake in, reverse all the way down that hill. It was not pleasant at all. But it is what it is. Gearbox is now a freak out.
clutch is not going to like this at all. side either for pedestrians thank you oh that was horrid that was a proper workout to take out there sheesh I am I can feel that I'm rubbing the curb all the way along there um, if I can snake this God, this route is a workout, this delivery. There we go. I just need to be able to get out to a road. Of course, because I've got the Moffat on, the tag is down as well. So, maneuverability is not the best. I am just living in mirrors. I'm feeling more times looking at my mirrors than I am actually looking forward right now. Didn't help that there's a 13 foot bridge. So there would be a quick easy route for me to have gone out. It would allow me to turn left out of that bit. But there's a 13 foot bridge and I'm 13 foot four. And now an ambulance coming in. It's only a patient transport ambulance. Let's try not to the curb too much. Oh, there we go. Off the curb. Okay. We'll upset some people potentially. Uh, okay, there. Jeez. Why is this a stop sign? Oh, it's because that's a car park exit. Fine, well, there's no one coming in. That's going out from that left there. It was not a nice place to go. Okay, let's go this way a bit more. Screw, I'm a celebrity, I'm a trucker, get me out of it. And of course now, I have cars squeezing down the inside of me. I need to find somewhere to stop and call the office. <sighs> Breathe. Breathe. I will catch back with you in a moment.
Welcome back. I've been given my marching orders. I am now going to Swaddling Coat Derby and then after that going up to Bradford. So I've been about my 45. So I have a clean four and a half. I am waiting to see what this foreign driver is trying to do. I'm just trying to find a parking. Trying to get into a parking spot, didn't realise there wasn't a parking spot. I don't quite know where he's going right now. Yeah, I have no idea where he's at. He's going. Understandably, he's busy trying to figure out what to do to reverse and to get my for me to get his attention. So I'm going. Totally fair enough. So yeah, about an hour from the collection. And I know. Boy, let's take this shortcut. not expect that. I just seen how long it took that Arctic to get into that parking spot, so I'm kind of in shock that he's now putting out. <sighs> the joys of services. Genuinely, some services spots are easier for Arctics to get out of than rigid when they got a tag down and they're off hanging off the back. Because the fact they can do that kink and do quite a sharp turn, it generally seems a bit easier for some of them to get out. And thankfully, the Civic has just let me out. Come on, truck! Come on! Come on, go! Come on! Get up to speed! Yes, I'm going to a plastics company to get some to take to a Tesco's. Not Tesco's RDC, a Tesco store. So, God knows where it actually is that I'm collecting. But anyway, I have about 40, yeah, about 40 miles to my collection. Let's get that foot down, oh crud. Now I've got things joining from the slip that I need to create space for. There we go, make sure create space. Uh, I was opening that little caravan thing that was a barbecue shit thing, you know, coffee shack. Onwards to the collection!
weather has changed yet again. I was getting quite warm earlier and had to have my sunglasses on because it was that bright. And then, I don't know if it came across in the time lapse, I can't even remember what it was. Okay, GoPro, start recording. I stupidly said the word I shouldn't have said. I don't know if it came across in the video prior where time was going at a different speed. Um, it got very dark. Very dark. And now it's brightened up a little bit. But it's still not bright necessarily and it's raining. Yay! This is what we all want. Uh, okay. Come on. I'm intrigued on what on earth it is that I'm taking up to direct to a store. It's, um, it's not very common to take stuff direct to stores. It's more common to go to RDCs and then they take it in. Go over the roundabout, but, um, take the second right, exit. Whatever this is, I'm taking it direct to the store. Just now looking. The company I'm collecting from do plastic plastics and stuff. Take the second exit. So, yeah. Who knows? I don't know how big it is, but it's palletized, I don't know how much it's got off it offload, I know nothing! I just know it's got to be on and gone. Okay. Oh shush! My sat nav freaks out a lot about waiting for me. Take the fourth exit. Then just realised where I am. Right. This After right 1,000 feet, turn no. right. One of the left. No, no. 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 It's this one. Yeah. Take the next right. Ah, 
I have no idea what I'm picking up. speak to their office. I will be back at some point. Right. Oh. It is muddy. So, collection done. Yeah. Um, because of a cock up when I went into their office, I just need to double check something. Uh, ah, close enough. Fine. Okay. <clears throat> Turns out what I've collected is four pallets of. Blue UPCs, they're called. Totes. And I got four pallets of them. So I've just done internal straps on the side, then used two internals, stretched them out so I've got a crisscross going on. Uh, no, it's not been a break. I really need a wee and they haven't really got one. Even there's snap parking here, they haven't really got a toilet. Yeah. Uh what? Yes. I need to I need to get hold of a bit of a dress. Go. This is an incredibly muddy sight. I don't know if the camera just caught that. I hope it did. Take the next light. That. What the? Okay. Calculate yeah, that, that. That turns right it. Pull that. Taking the third exit. The door. Unlocked and open. Take the third exit. So, 
that sat nav does not know about the river that it's worried about. So, well, yeah, it's actually it's a pretty huge road. So there we go. Uh, be careful because I've got. I'm gonna still have some mud on my tyres. So I won't have necessarily the traction that I hope I'd have. And also incredibly frustrating if this was actually quicker routed. And the route I took. It would be incredibly annoying. Strangely, it has no concept that these roads are here. Like some of those units, it's really old. Ah, now I'm onto the old bit of road. Fine. These two now in agreement about where I'm going. Of course Take not. The next right. Why would they? So, this wants me to basically spin a Yui, go all the way around the room. Where are you going? You're going there. Okay, good, because I'm going to go all around here. Hopefully it won't go missing. Slash flying anyway. My glory fruit. Car's going away. No problem. Two lorries. Tight side. So for the sake of few seconds lost pulling the uh, yarding from down the hill. <coughs> this is going to be tight. I need momentum! There we go. What's so much necessary I just can't bring it. What's so much need momentum? Just need gearbox to stop playing games and give me drive. Right, this way, let's go that way. Where am I going? That way. Fine. Enter the roundabout. Take the third exit. So now is the fun. Me absolutely positively hauling bums up to Bradford and then have fun when I get there about where on earth and how the, these tips. How am I going onto the bay? How am I going to tip my Moffat? Who knows? Oh, you'll know in a few minutes when the footage gets there. So, um, you have an advantage. For me, it's a period of time away till I find out. And, oh, of course, there's a car I want to turn into a little Tesco. And there's a Greg! Oh. Salt now. No, the Greg's and nowhere to park. Recalculating route. Take the next left. Salt. Decided. Sulking is in order. Get with it, Greg's. Whenever you. From now on, whenever you uh, put in the planning in, or just planning a new store, or an upgrade to a store. HGV parking. Just telling you. Recalculating route. It's a money Turn making back idea. Possible. Then take the next left. Recalculating route. Have I just got. Yes, take I have. Take the next right. Then 
I think that's how you... Or whether they'll let me just 
where they have a forklift. They have a forklift, they're not going to stay on. Um, or I get the muffin off and I forklift it off myself. I don't know. I don't know which way it's going to happen. As long as these four pallets come off, they, that's the main thing. Um, hello, motorbike. I do know that once I've done it here, I will need to have a break. Um, but I'm just hoping. But maybe a foolish hope, I don't know. Part of me is hoping I can make it back to the M1 and uh, to the services and have a break there. I'd say it might be a foolish hope, but you never know. Oh, and pre worn there will be job cuts. Maybe periods of time where I'm quiet. So I'm just going to jump cut. I mean, I have started the cameras quite a bit early. So I'm still 20 minutes out. But, yeah. Out. Yes, I have. Damn it! Take the fourth exit. Damn it! Recalculating route. It's alright. Can make it back. Back here, back onto it. Took the wrong turn. Like the wrong exit. Which is really clever of me to have done that. I mean, it hasn't blown that I'm about to hit the weight limit really yet, so that's the main thing. Uh, but I do need to get over here. It's like a velodrome or something there. The building just says sport on the side of it. Come on, truck. Give me some drive. Take the fifth exit. Cheeky Mercedes. Very cheeky. I 
mean, it's a supermarket. I'm sure that's a spotty. I mean, I can see the logo. On the side of a very big, 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 big building. driving hours out, trucker timer. It's about four minutes ahead of what my tack ahead is. Ah. I've had it worse. After 100 okay. feet, turn left. And then from my research. Take the next turn right. Turn right in a moment. attention. Fine. I'll be back in a moment. Ah. Delivery done. Um, what I've just delivered is, if you see those left hand side, those pallets of bloody crates. That's what I've just delivered. Turns out there you probably see in the distance a big red thing. That's a uh, scissor lift. Goes up to rear doors of trucks. It's just been installed. It's not been signed off by an electrician yet, so they're not allowed to use it. They were very health thankful that I had a Moffat unit, my own forklift, so I could tip myself. Yeah. They were very happy about that fact. Uh, right. No. Oh, all right. Then. Uh, here we go, a nice fun reverse to do now. I'm going to reverse some blind.
my day's just gone from a bit shitty to a lot worse. You may have noticed the uh, abrupt stop in the last bit. Yeah, I didn't see uh, in my mirror the canopy sticking out beyond what's there for where they load their vehicles for the home delivery. Uh, and I've caught the buildings. Damaged from the guttering, damaged, done some damage to the rear doors of the truck. Um, yeah. I'll be glad when this day's over. I'm just having one of those days. But, reported it to my office, obviously reported it to the store, gave them contact details for the company. Uh, the store basically said, don't worry about it kind of thing. But, it depends what their higher up management say. Um, just because there's some damage to a gutter. But I've got to now go and do. I've now got to do. <laughs> best part of a two hour drive back. I've got enough drive time. It's still calculating. Best part of a two hour drive back. That's 45 away. To then do insurance paperwork. Need to say I got some ribbon from the staff members there. Unsurprisingly. But then they pointed out some damage that a um, an international driver caused to part of the building. Oh, I am going to end the vlog there. Yeah. Days I'm kicking myself severely about what's just happened. I've annoyed myself. And I'll do paperwork when I get back. close to me as I'm turning to get out from there. Another thing I don't really want to be dealing with, but no much choice. After 600 feet, turn right. Okay, well this let me turn. Calculate route. I just want to go home. What, what are you After doing, Saya? Right. There's a queue of traffic. Apparently the queue of traffic don't count for that person.
Thank you for watching. I still have a job at the end of this. I'll be catching you next time. In the meantime, please do remember to like, comment, subscribe. Call me a muppet in the comments. All I care. I just... Yeah. Be well, John Spartan. Till next time. Bye bye.